Hi and welcome to a tutorial over mole volume conversions. Today you'll need out your notes as well as a calculator. So in my opinion, this third conversion factor, which is one mole equals 22.4 liters, is the easiest to deal with. What it does is it gets us from moles to liters and vice versa. So let's talk about this for a second. It says, in your notes, Avogadro discovered something special about gases and moles. He found that at the same temperature and pressure, equal volumes of gases contain equal numbers of moles. For right now, we'll just stick to the case of standard temperature and pressure, or STP. This is defined as zero degrees Celsius in one atmosphere of pressure. Under conditions of STP, one mole of any gas has a volume of 22.4 liters. So this is your third conversion factor that we've learned. And like I said, I think this is the easiest one to deal with. So here are some sample problems using that conversion factor that one mole is equal to 22.4 liters. Now it has to say in the problem at STP for this to be true. So you'll notice in all of our sample problems, it will say that. Okay, so number one, how many moles of neon are in 44.8 uh, liters of neon at STP? So 44.8 liters is our given. The unknown is how many moles. So I'm going to start my problem with the 44.8 liters of neon. Because I have liters that I'm starting with, I need liters on the bottom, and I need moles on the top. Okay. So what numbers go in there? One mole is equal to 22.4 liters. So I just plug it in. Liters cancel. And using my calculator and solving, I find that this is equal to two moles of neon. And again, taking into account the number of significant figures in the given to make sure you're rounding correctly. Okay, let's try number two. Number two, how many liters of carbon dioxide gas are in 33 moles of carbon dioxide gas at STP? So, 0.33 moles is my given of carbon dioxide. And I'm converting to liters this time. So, moles should go on the bottom and liters should go on the top. So, if you've noticed, it's always one mole is equal to something. One mole is equal to 22.4 liters. I put this in my calculator and I solve 7.4 liters of carbon dioxide gas. Okay, as usual, go ahead and try number three on your own. Pause the video. Okay, welcome back. Hopefully you had success with number three. Let's go ahead and try it together. How many moles of helium gas are in 1.25 liters of helium gas at STP? So the 1.25 liters is my given. And moles are unknown. So I'm starting with 1.25 liters of helium. Liters have to go on the bottom. Moles have to go on the top. For every one mole, I have 22.4 liters. Units of liters cancel, and after putting this in my calculator and rounding to three significant figures, make sure you did that, I get 0 0.0558 moles of helium. So after watching this video, you should be able to convert between moles, atoms, molecules, and formula units. You should be able to convert between moles and grams, and you should be able to convert between moles and liters. I hope you enjoy your evening and that this tutorial was helpful.